but we're gonna do a weekly wind up and I haven't done one of these in I don't know two weeks right two weeks yeah and the last time that I talked to you or was it a week ago I don't even remember a week ago let me get my self together all right so the last time I talked to you guys I told you that I quit my job yay and guess what you guys you're actually the first ones to find out I got a new job boom hey go on it's your birthday go on it's your birthday I'm so happy so I went to a really important meeting yesterday I got to meet everybody that I'm gonna be working with and it was just really cool and everybody is nice so I'm really excited it's really close to home really really close to home I'm working regular hours with like really cool people and it's gonna be so much fun and I'm excited <sighs> okay I had to get that out so anyway last week I know we did not do a normal weekly wind up so this week we will so let's go ahead and take a look at TMZ I have not checked TMZ at all this week so I don't know what they really talked about so let's see Dave Chappelle is apparently mad at reports saying he is pro-Trump. Well, according to TMZ, he's pissed at reports saying he's pro-Trump. Eh, that's good enough. I don't have to read anymore. The subject line basically says it all. Mariah Carey and James Packer, the craziest prenup ever. I didn't even know she was getting married, so okay. We're negotiating one of the most insane prenups we've ever seen. So apparently Mariah's people rejected the um, prenup saying it was tacky and insulting among the conditions except for gifts between them for their engagement wedding or on birthdays and anniversaries no item of jewelry and or personal um, adornment costing over 250,000 will be deemed a gift unless accompanied by or promptly followed by a writing specifically stating this is my gift to you what the heck <laughs> So, Danny Mathers, do you guys know who she is? She is the playboy, playmate, who took the picture of the girl at the, I think it was the LA Fitness, um, when the woman was changing or getting out of the shower. So, apparently, she has been charged with a crime and can face, I think it's up to six months in jail. So, I'm going to say that what she did was very disgusting. I mean, look, we all go through our things. I, at one point, I was 209 pounds. I was working on losing weight just because you don't think that I am cute or whatever. It does not mean that you have a right to take a Snapchat of me and put it out there for the whole entire world to see. You are an evil, evil person. Evil. And apparently, little Wayne is kind of like he doesn't like to get in the mix of the whole Black Lives Matter movement um, I guess it's I, I don't know I don't know if it's a money thing I don't know what it is with him but he's just kind of like don't talk to me about it you want to talk about about my music cool we can talk about my rap we can talk about my music but anything else don't get me into politics don't do it I can respect that why <laughs> Why does Mel Gibson look like a weird Santa Claus? Or he kind of looks like an Amish dude. <laughs> That's what he looks like. I don't know, I'm confused. Alright, so that's pretty much everything from TMZ. Let's go into some of the magazines. Okay, so we'll just go ahead and get started with Star Magazine. Um, Maddox slams Brad Pitt and says you are not my father that's not really news because we all kind of know that but whatever yikes Tara Reid is really really uh, her legs are so yikes I think she's gonna die she is really, really sickly, sickly thin, like, yikes. Let me go show Greg this. All right, I just showed Greg. <laughs> Y'all should have saw the look on his face. He was like, yikes. Oh my, Juliette Lewis. She's kind of like older, but she looks pretty good. I mean, 
She is kind of old, right? I don't even know how old she is. Let's ask Siri. How old is Juliet Lewis? Juliet Lewis is 43. Oh, she's only 43. That's kind of young. That's young because, yeah. I'll be 43 before you know it. <laughs> wow, Jay Wow and Snooki celebrate the 50th episode of their reality show. Oh, I didn't even know that was still on. Snooki and Jay Wow, Moms with Attitude. But the main reason I'm talking about this is because they have the most amazing bowl of spaghetti and meatballs I think I've ever seen. What? I want to go out and eat with them. <laughs> this is talking about Rosie O'Donnell. But I don't really care about her. We were just talking about Mariah getting married. Now she's dumped. Let's see what my horoscope says. Taurus, full moon energy will make you feel emotional and put you in touch with your feelings. The sun in your love zone shines on relationships. Be social. I don't have to be social. I have my man. All right, so that's it for Star Magazine. Let's take a look at people. So there is a, I guess, new show coming on called good girls revolts but their hair is what i'm most concerned with and it is so cool i love it especially the girl all the way on the right like her hair is bomb and i love it and i want to do my hair like that but it probably will never you guys i just saw corn mashed potatoes but that's not the big thing the thing is is that do you guys realize that thanksgiving is like really really close like this this year is like over can you believe it so apparently kanye west is bitter about beyonce it says kanye west went off on jay-z recently ranting at a show about jay-z not visiting after kim kardashian's paris ordeal and nothing and noting that our kids have never even played together. But a source says it's Beyonce he's really angry with. Kanye spent years gushing about her. The insider said, um, but she doesn't like him. And it causes big problems. That's not news. I kind of knew that years ago. So, next. So, apparently, Jennifer Aniston credits her dad for her long thick beautiful hands. I've never heard anybody say I have long thick beautiful hands. Aren't these gorgeous? <laughs> Whatever. That's weird. This says why Angelina really filed for soul custody. Let's be real. Um, she's getting a divorce from her husband and um, she hates him. Only because I've been there before girlfriend. I understand. But my ex was really a dirtbag. And on the child sex offender registry. Do you have that? Can you beat me? Do you? No. Mm. The Duggars are in crisis and they are divorce papers. Do you know who they are? The Duggars. They have like 50 billion kids and one of them is a pervert or a cheater or something. Yeah. That. Okay. Well, that's it you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this drink and we'll go ahead and end this here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below if you guys do all three. As always, I promise to love you guys forever and we will see you guys in the next vlog after I've finished my first full week at my new job. Isn't that exciting? Congratulate me, you guys. Congratulate me. Hello. I'm just saying.